Hello, uh, today I'm visiting a single family house with uh, integrated heating and cooling system and uh, controlled by Icon uh, first generation controller. So here we have a uh, heat pump which uh, may produce heat or uh, summertime cool. Uh, heating, cooling is uh, switching between uh, one and another depending on outside temperature. So for example, this guy, uh, heat pump decides when it is uh, heating season or then it is uh, cooling season. So right now is a summertime and it is cooling season. Outside we have uh, plus 28 degrees and uh, we supply plus 18 degrees chilled water to our underfloor heating system. And it is being controlled by uh, Danfoss Icon first generation uh, controller. Uh, controller is with uh, expansion module which uh, uh, is connected to dew point sensor. Dew point sensor uh, checks uh, is there a moisture on a manifold or there are not. If there is no moisture everything is okay, everything is working. If moisture appears, so sensor is senses somewhere around 95% of humidity, so nearly 100. Uh, and sends a signal to icon controller and stops it temporarily to, uh, to, to, to stop system for a while to get rid of uh, uh, moisture. So, uh, here we have uh, application, I guess, application 004. So, it means uh, a heat pump uh, sends signal to icon controller when heat pumps want uh, uh, cooling and uh, demand uh, for the cooling from a house is being supplied uh, with a boiler, boiler relay to a heat pump. So they both uh, talk to each other and heat pump switches between heating and cooling and the icon uh, tells this, the heat pump uh, for calls for a demand for cooling or for heating. And the application here is 004. So we supply 18 degrees, uh, outside is plus 28, and we may check now how much we have on a return. These red, yeah, these red are actuators, not maybe red, maybe yellow, and uh, they show us these actuators are working, they are open because they are NC type uh, calling for a cooling. Some others are resting, they are closed, cooling is not needed. So yeah, what we have on a return, we have something like a 23 degrees uh, return temperature from our underfloor, uh, let's say cooling right now. Okay, now we may go to the house and check uh, the surface temperature, how much uh, we have on a surface. Okay, right now I am in a living room and I would like to check uh, what kind of temperatures we have. Uh, floor temperature, room temperature, set temperatures. Okay, let's start from uh, our uh, room thermostat. It shows 24.8 degrees. So we, this is our real temperature we have at the moment. Uh, snow sign here shows we have uh, cooling demand and uh, we may check uh, our set temperature. Our set temperature is 21 degree. Covering here is uh, uh, vinyl covering. Uh, and uh, right now we will check uh, how much we have. Our floor surface temperature. So uh, our thermal vision camera shows something like 23.5, 22.9. So yeah, in average, let's say it is uh, 23. So uh, floor surface temperature is 23 degrees Celsius. And uh, by feeling, I can say it is. it feels comfortable. It doesn't feel it is uh, too cold. Maybe on a different surface, let's say tiles, uh, it might feel maybe colder. And uh, maybe on uh, wooden floors, it may feel a little bit warmer, but uh, with vinyl covering, this is quite okay. 
and I feel comfortable. So I hope it was useful. Thanks for watching. See you. Thank <music> you.